So I made a nicer enclosure for my leopard geckos who are currently sitting in there, right? Yeah, that's the uh, female um, tail. That is right there. and But that's uh, the male's foot. <laughs> Well, they get the water bowl right here, and a small hide, which I have seen them use, their food bowl, main hide. Then I kind of did like a weird, like a, like I made a burrow for them. Oh, there's a poopy. But I made, <laughs> but I made a burrow for them. And they have also used that. Here's another angle. Right there, you can see the male's head. The focus is. There's the female's eye, but I think they get a good angle at her. Here's my anole tank. Where, as I was telling you, yeah, uh, six anoles. It's a pretty big tank. It's big enough. I got two live plants, and then until the, these grow in, which I'm doing, sure saying they should within a little while. I have some uh, fake plants up here to fill in the spaces that they will need to hide, but once the this plant here and that uh, plant over there grow in, I will take the fake plants out because I think it will look much nicer. Same, they got a water bowl and the food bowl. But um, I have a big water bowl because I used to have tree frogs in here, but I don't anymore. This is my Pac-Man frog tank. He's got his water bowl and some fake plants in a bush. And his spot is generally, he just stays right there. But he has uh, moved, like sometimes he's over here or he's been in that corner. But most of the time he just stands right there. He's a little baby albino Pac-Man frog. And then a 10 gallon tank. Uh, this is the beer dragon tank. They've got a food bowl right there. And again, gotta clean that. Um, and got some rocks right here. It's a big, I uh, forgot what that's called, but it's like a hollow piece of wood thing that they can go in, which she has once, but the crickets hide in there too. They can hide under and then they like come out sometimes. And then there's a rock back there and a big log that gets them to a high spot in the tank so they can get pretty warm. And um, keep them on this. There's some like soup worms and mealworms in the dirt. Yeah, 